Hello everybody, my name is Provis and welcome back to more CK3 Princes of Darkness playing as Ma'apkare of Mahreb. We have taken a lot of territory and now we are running into a situation where I'm trying to win a big war over here and I'm being attacked by an Inquisition cell who are trying to siege down Tangiers, which is going to be annoying. If I can get these guys to abandon this siege, that would be the ideal situation, but I don't think they're going to fall for it. Unfortunately, so we're gonna lose some war score in just a moment. We were this close to getting the ticking war score I was looking for, but that's fine. Let them retreat. We can re-siege this very quickly, and that should get me back up to 100% once it is done, as long as I can't seize something back in the next 38 days, which I'm gonna go with guaranteed, yeah, we're gonna be fine. So I'm gonna take a whole nother duchy in just a moment. Boom, got it, 100%, thank you. Let's go ahead and end this and go elsewhere. So, I need you guys to split up because we're taking a stupid amount of attrition. One of you actually go over this way. Let's split them up so we don't take up all of our supply limit. And you are going to be going all the way up over here. Well, we apparently don't have you selected anymore. Hang on. There we go. And you are going to go all the way up over... Uh, primarily going through all this territory, so we don't accidentally jump on each other. There we go. And how long is it going to take for you to siege? 15 months. It's a pretty long time. Pretty darn long time. Alright, we need some new characters, and I'm now in debt. That's not good. Um, let's see. Some of ca skills. Somebody who would be talented in something would be great. Maybe intrigue? We could get somebody with 16 intrigue. You wouldn't be bad. Yeah, um, but you're not in my court. You, I could give some titles. You're not that good. I need money more than anything. So having somebody with at least a bit of... There we go. Some stewardship and some marshal for the levy as well as some money would be great. Gosh dang it with this whole invite to court nonsense. Fine. I guess we're going to have to do you. You get both of these. And then somebody I do not care about, who hates me, can get the heck out of here. Okay. And of course we are gonna... Well, I don't have the money, never mind. We can't create the title, but that's fine. No duchy title technically exists. That's gonna be a very disloyal vassal for a little bit. Oh, whatever, it'll be fine. Uh, and now we have the faction war. Oh god, so now on top of all of this, I've also got to deal with a civil war. <sighs> right, okay. Well, I'm still pretty strong, it turns out, but a lot of people have betrayed my trust. A lot of people. The Inquisition certainly does not help situations. Uh, I'm going to ransom you so we are not in debt for a minute. I can call on my ally, and I'm going to, specifically in the civil war. Spend the prestige. And now we need to go and kill all of these little guys over here. They've all betrayed me. You fools. Every one of you are fools. Gosh dang it. So now it's going to be a little bit harder for me to fight my way over to Tangiers. If we can win some of these sieges quickly, maybe we can do something though. A few months, they're sieging down Fez right now. Okay. My levy obviously has dropped substantially. Lots of desertion going on here because, you know, they took a lot. And I'm losing so much money because my armies cost a frick ton. I did greatly increase the size of my levy, didn't I? And uh, it's coming back to bite me. Being in debt is not good. Not good at all. Alright, so we'll get that. I can't worry about the Inquisition right now, unfortunately. And that's going to reduce my money and my levy and such by quite a bit more. They're about to siege down Fez. And here comes some reinforcements for them. Okay. They've got 5,000 troops. They've got uh, as much as I do. Good thing I have an ally. Hopefully that ends up being helpful. We can imprison this person. 92% chance. I'll take it. Okay. Can we get up here to Tangiers and win? Not easily. A new prisoner. Done. Thank you. One problem I've got is this person shouldn't have two titles. The fact that you have two counties is one of the reasons you've been strong enough to be a threat. I need to take these counties away from you and give them to someone else and break up your power. You're too powerful for a count. Alright, so Tangiers is being sieged. Let's go ahead and unsiege it real quick. We're at 38% progress. Where's Ghana? Oh, there's another one over here, of course, Asfi. So Ghana's on the way. I think they're probably going to go siege this. 
It looks like it's really one, two, three, four, five vassals that are causing the issue. All right, King Nessie of Ghana, my daughter over here, is now my heir. He, apparently, people have changed their vote. Conscripting the Outlaws is done here in Tlemcen, so that's going to get me a fair bit of extra levy that I'll be able to use eventually. Though I've obviously still lost a lot. Uh, we'll need to be conscripting some more rabble and stuff in the future. Being out of money is probably the biggest problem that I can see right now. Having no money means we're going to have big problems. Bankrupt, gain money, or I can get stressed. Yes, let's try that. Dang it! Even when the odds are heavily in my favor, like, I still can't win, can I? Nope. Alright, Tangiers will be unseaged in just a moment. They're still sieging down other people's holdings. That's kind of not important. I'm going to go siege this down. Control all four of these, and that will leave, I think, just Osfi and Maluya to siege down. Okay, we now control Tangiers again. These guys are apparently... No, don't attack them. They're getting on boats to go elsewhere. That's fine for right now. I'll worry about you later. Go elsewhere. Is Ghana planning on stacking up on me? Is that the plan here? I don't think he wants to fight all of these guys for some reason. Okay, 51% right now. We've got to go siege these. Alright, with Ghana's help, I hope we can beat down something over here. We fight well in the dry lands, but it says my odds are pretty bad. Well, let's see if by unseaging one of my own personal holdings, we can get a lion's share of war score back. Isabella has joined the courts with claims on all of England again. Wow. My great grandson has been taken prisoner, and I'm missing a spy master. I don't have 150 freaking gold. Good God. This character's good, but isn't a powerful vassal, so doesn't need to join. We don't have any good spy masters. Well, you're my best candidate at the moment, so I'm going to have to put you in that position, even if I don't like it. Yes, I know I'm grossly in debt. Thank you. Okay, we have to stack up and go kill. Have to. It's time. And with Ghana's help, we should be able to win something. He's stacking up everything he's got over here. And you're fighting someone else all of a sudden. Well, hello. That will weaken you at least a bit until my reinforcements can arrive. Enemies left the war? Oh, Osfi has left the war because the Inquisitors sieged him down so he can't be a part of this anymore and they captured him. Ha 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 ha. Right. Um, okay. Where... Ghana, why did you... Ghana backed off. God! You just put me in a losing situation because you backed off, and they have superior troop quality. And I don't think you're gonna arrive in time, so we have to back off now. Which means we're gonna lose some numbers. Thanks for that, moron. And now Ghana's getting attacked. God... I don't understand AI vas uh, allies sometimes. It's the primary reason I just cannot stand using allies. Relying on them is just a mistake through and through. Alright, let's go siege this. And hopefully by sieging down literally all the top holdings of everybody who is involved in this rebellion, hopefully we'll be able to finish this off. Now the Inquisition is sieging down Marrakesh. We have to get some control back here in Tangiers. Can we convert anybody else? Yeah, let's go ahead and convert you. Alright, so they're split up. They've taken a lot of damage. Where did Ghana go? Are they running all the way back home? Not they're back. They're coming back up here. Alright, so we'll have to deal with this. They're actually going to unsiege a fort that they took for the sake of the Inquisition. Which actually works against... Uh, which actually works for me, I think. New factions have been created. Gosh dang it. Why are you a problem? A friend who hates me. I can't seem to keep this realm together right now, and we have such a huge freaking deficit right now. Focus recruitment. Levy size. Thank you. If only that made a big difference. I need to take some dang prisoners and ransom them. 
All right, well, that'll work. 75% uh, chance and 93% chance. I'll take what I can. We need to get these guys together and see if we can crush the Inquisition. I can ransom one of you for 10. That's not worth much. Ghana, what are you up to? You're unseaging some stuff from the Inquisition. Which is sort of helpful. If I can get these troops together... Okay, so that takes, again, another fort to the Inquisition, who is not really my problem right now. We've got to go kill this. So let's get all my troops together. They have lower troop quality, which means now we have a good chance we can win a fight against them. And Ghana apparently is fighting them for me, so that actually just finished off the Inquisition regardless. Thank you. The locals have been pacified. Okay. So you now want to run away. I'm not surprised. Let's get our reinforcements. Now we go kill. This will end the war. Tell me we can win this. We have such a huge numbers advantage. Do you just have like 50 knights? They got 22 knights! No wonder they're crushing me when you get that many counts working together, even if I have a huge numbers advantage. Even if. Wow. Okay. Ugh, all right. Well, if we can siege down what? These two counties, that will end things. Gosh, this has been a very costly civil war. Very costly civil war. We lost our marshal? All right, we're going to reassign you as my marshal instead then. And this is the best I got? She's not even good. All right. Keep getting control. We'll see what happens with you. Actually, you know what? No. If you're still going to be disloyal to me, then forget you. I'm going to put this guy in charge. Someone loyal. You always want to have a loyal spy master. Bad things happen when your spy master hates you. Bad things happen when you're this much in debt. God! Ugh. Tell me you're not going to win this dang siege. Three months. Oh, for the love of God! They're going to keep this war going a little bit longer here. Simply by virtue of getting one more siege. I can't keep doing this. I've got to get out. Got to get out. Alright. Well, we get this back at least. 94% war score again. So, I don't know where they're going to go. They might try to take one of their things back. Nope, they're going to run away. Who are we sieging? Oh, we missed a fort here. What? I don't know who this is sieged by, but whatever. Turn around. Forget this. We don't need to go re-siege anything. If I just smash him right now, we win. Or you can run away. That also works. Fine. One army go over there. One of you. Keep him the heck out of here. And hopefully winning this siege is all I'm going to need. Ugh. And we have been doing so well up until this point, and all of a sudden, everything's just getting really, really nasty. We will be able to extort some of these guys. Murder Isabella. My guest? Claimant of England? I don't care. 99% war score? Are you kidding me? Alright, well, Ghana's on the way, and that ends the war. Thank God. Be done. Crime. I can imprison all of these people. We are going to imprison all of these people. Disband. My god. Okay. Uh, now comes the risk of can we imprison all these people without getting horribly wounded? I could try to do things like a blood surge. Which will get me some prowess. Uh, I could also maybe do a shapeshift. Dread. Feral weapons. Prowess. Befriending and seduction is less likely to work. Again with this 50% chance of blood hunger though. But 15 dread and some feral weapons with prowess. I think it's time to do this. We're going to extend my claws. 
All right, my blood hunger did in fact go up, but at least now I have better prowess. Rip him apart, rip him apart, rip him apart, rip him apart, rip him apart. Five prisoners, please. Dang it! How did I get freaking wounded after all of that nonsense? All right. So. Hi, you. You hold a county. This one right here. A county which, in my opinion, you no longer have any right to. That said, if I can find ways to get your stats up, what if... Oh wait, you're... Oh, hang on. I'm gonna have you ransom your own prisoner back. There we go. So, this count... Up over here? Right here? No. Way over here, I'm sorry. You're one of the- oh right, you're one of the people that I hated. Okay, so I'm okay with ransoming you, and the reason I'm okay with this is one, I need money. Two, once I create a duchy title, I'm gonna shuffle him under someone else so he's no longer a headache. That's the plan. So let's just go ahead and get myself out of a little bit of debt. And then you, cultist, who doesn't even have enough money, you, I'm thinking I might release in exchange for a favor. And the reason I can do that is you're zealous, which means you hate that I'm of the wrong faith. If I get a hook on you, I might be able to force you to convert your faith, in which case maybe you won't be disloyal again in the future. So we're going to try that. I've got a hook on you. I demand your conversion, and I will use your ho the hook. You must accept, surely. Gain a weak hook on me? Fine. He's got a hook on me, but hopefully I will be able to use that in the future against him. So there we go. Now we have a hundred opinion up to you. <sighs> Alright. So that's all done. Um... I can change your contract, and I will use a hook to try and get some levy out of you. Or... You don't pay, like, any taxes to begin with. Keep the hook on him for now, that'll be fine. Can demand payments, no. Can imprison criminals, yep. I'm going to imprison you. There we go. And I'm going to be imprisoning you. And I'm going to be imprisoning you. Why can't I imprison you? Known criminal. Alright, fine. Imprison him anyway. Okay, so we have a lot of prisoners all of a sudden. So many of them need to face justice. At this point, I'm tempted to say, screw it, let's just execute them. You, for example. I'm gonna revoke one of your titles, for sure. You're not allowed to have this. You lose that. So I take this for myself until I can grant it to someone else who will be loyal to me. Grant to, um, you. Yes. And you actually would make for a good spy master. Holy crap, you went up to 28 intrigue? How the heck did that happen? Yes, please. And we need to sway you and get you on my side. Holy crap, we got a really good spy master. I can start murdering again. That feels pretty good. Okay. Uh, what else we got here? So, other prisoners. Let's deal with you. So, you're a countess, way down over here, in Ifni. I don't know what she did that was illegal. Ifni, that is to say. You're not technically my problem, though. Mmm. Get a weak hook on you? That wouldn't do me a lot of good.
Well, I'm zealous, and you are kind of annoying me. So you know what I'm going to do? You're a criminal. I can just execute you. I can spend an absolute ton. Oh, hang on. Gets a secret. Diablerist. Loses... I satiate all my hunger. By eating you. Uh, I don't think I need to do that right now, though. I think we just go ahead and behead you. I'm done with you. Get a new heir. Someone else. Someone else can take over. Hi, Duchess. My granddaughter is the heir to this, and hopefully my granddaughter will be more loyal. Could ransom you for 90 gold. The thing is, you love me. I really don't see what the problem is. I'm gonna ransom you and just take the 90 gold. Help me get out of debt. You're loyal. You really shouldn't have been a problem in the first place. Other prisoners. This person, also in Ifni. Well, what's your problem? You're not worth the full amount of money. Alright, fine. I'm gonna hold on to you then. You! Way up over here. Now, is this in the Duchy of Tlemcen? It is. Something I think I'm gonna do is take your title, and I'm not going to give it back to you. You lose your title. Bye. Get out. So I lose some stress getting rid of my rival. Now, of course, having a, an extra holding is a problem. I'm trying to see exactly what the problem is. I don't think we're incurring any penalties yet. Because it's a recently acquired holding. We've got a little time to figure out what we're going to do with this. About a year. One year to figure out what to do over here. But having extra counties in my own personal duchy is generally a pretty good thing, right? Let's see. Oh, hello, Baroness. Yeah, you're also a problem. 30 gold, huh? But you're going to continue being issues. I think we execute you. And I'm gonna behead you and gain some dread. Bye. Okay. What else? You're still here, huh? This would be an act of tyranny. If I did this. Because I already took one title away from him. I could gain a favor on him. Demand conversion. I could banish you. Here we go. Banished from the realm. He's deposed. This is a way of just taking away his territory. Yep, you're done. Get out. Okay, so he'll accept that. He's gone. New person in charge, but this person's not as disloyal as the other ones. We have so many freaking prisoners. Take some money from you. Oh, hello. Right, yes, you also were a traitor, weren't you? Uh... I think I'm gonna revoke your title, too. Get out. Okay. You are my granddaughter. Hmm. I think I'll have you renounce your claims, and I'm going to get a hook on you just to be safe. Get rid of you. Okay. So this takes care of quite a bit more. Taking a long time trying to reestablish everything here, but I can't keep having things like this happen to me. 100 gold? You've got three claims, but you're unlanded. How do we even capture you? You've got a hundred freaking gold. Yes, please. And then there's just you who can't afford your full amount. Where do you have a temple? You have a temple. Right. All right, we'll tell you what. When you've got enough money, then we can worry about it. So being over my holding limit is obviously a problem. 
It'd be nice to hold on to these, but it's not strictly necessary. I can give it up to somebody else. We're about to be out of debt. Thank God that's finally taken care of. Can demand some payments. Oh, right. The per my uh, daughter or granddaughter, whatever. And we can arrest this countess again. Didn't we just release you? I thought that we did, but apparently not. Huh. Hi. I'm gonna keep you in here as well. Okay. Well, that was fun to deal with. Looks like Tunis has taken over the rest of this territory over here. And you're fairly strong. Sea of Shadows is not as strong as I might have expected. India has somehow taken more territory, and I, I really don't know how you did it, but you did. Can I form this kingdom? Yep, if I can get the money together, we absolutely can form that kingdom. Alright, I conceded my banishment reason. I am claiming what I am owed. I expect you to publicly concede your rights to punish me and grant forgiveness. Huh? You conceded... what? I don't know why we got that pop-up. Abu al baka blah 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 blah. Um... So, why, why would I want to bring you to court? I, I've brought two people to court so far and have not yet found them. I have no idea how useful they actually are. We need to cover up my masquerade. There's a chance of becoming seriously injured, uh, and I would gain a load of stress. That's not good. Yeah, being wounded right now certainly isn't helping me. We have 90 dread all of a sudden. If that doesn't scare the frick out of people, then I don't know what will. I don't like you as my steward anymore. Anyone better? Yes, my daughter. You take over instead. She'll be disloyal forever, but I don't care anymore. Alright, looking good then. Gaining some opinion over here of my uh, spy master. That's good. Trying to convert some territory, trying to regain some control. We have a very, very fractured realm. Can you please stop getting prestige so you stop calling me into wars? Because I don't actually want to be involved in any of these anymore. Who are we fighting? This little guy over here? He's got 2,000 troops. You've got... Oh, good lord. I have to fight you. <sighs> sure. Keep wasting my time. I have to disband some of these troops. Because it is costing me way too much money keeping them all up and running. So we're going to disband these guys. There. At least I won't go into debt. We'll send some reinforcements to try and help over in Ghana. At this point, like, this alliance is just not working out well for me. The Midnight Crescent appears to be growing. Would you please close your mouth? You look terrifying. I don't think I like it. You've got max exposure in the Masquerade. That's part of the problem. Yeah, I can't befriend people very well, but this Feral Weapons is pretty good. Unfortunately, my dread is changing a lot. My culture discovered Chronicle Writing. Oh, that's good. What does this do? Uh, can use individual du jour duchy cash this belly now. Okay. Well, that's actually helpful if you can form a kingdom title. We'll be able to use that to take over entire duchies using prestige instead of just my piety. Though at this point, we've also been doing really well on piety. You can afford 20 gold, you can afford 28. Mm, so you guys can afford the full amount. You can pay me 38. Yeah, this vassal likes me well enough. I think I'll just go ahead and try to get money from you too. Low control in lots of counties. Also disabil uh, dis disabled buildings in Fez. Why? They are resisting grumbling and stirring up trouble, are they? We should go ahead and upgrade this with a downtrodden, because we already found that uh, this just gets better over time. Tangiers, honestly, probably the same deal. 
If we can, we want to conscript the downtrodden. Rablin thugs, that's the one. Do it. Marrakesh, I don't know what to do with you yet. We may or may not end up keeping you. Small conscription effort. This, this would be helpful. Reduce men at arms maintenance. And it only costs me some control in a region. But it's not even that bad. The control's by default going up. We may want to start building some of those. Not sure I can afford to hold on to any of this. We're about to start having some penalties. Vassal opinion, domain levies and taxes. Wow. Being two over is reducing my taxes by 40%. Right, okay. Well, we have to pick some really good characters. Um, preferably those who do not already have a position. I'm going to say they have to be of my religion, too. Let's go for some of skills. You'll do fine. Yeah, we'll grant you a title. And... Another one. Not a lot of great characters here, but I think you'll do fine. I can't. You then? Fine. Grant this title. Alright, so that fixes that problem. Now we get 40% of our income back and 40% of our levy back. That helps. Uh, holy crud. I'm about to die. Okay, well that's not good. Time to run, dude. Okay, we are retreating. I lose some, not all. Ghana, um, I technically participated in this war and that's all you're getting out of me. If you lose this war, I do not care. I simply do not care. Another faction with power? Really? No, they don't. Wait, yes. Freaking Inquisition cells. Alright, I need to get my masquerade taken care of. 50% a chance of stress, 50% chance of blood hunger. Yeah, I'll be their god. Let's hope. Okay, I got the stress, but not quite enough to get to stress level 1. We are one off. My masquerade level went up by only 1. That's not a lot, but it does slow down the possibility of an Inquisition cell at least a bit. Where am I having this issue primarily? Marrakesh. So we need to get control back over here then. Well, for now you can continue with what you are doing in Tangiers, I suppose. That's probably fine. Uh, more conversions. Let's just continue converting everything nearby. Make sure that all these counties are happy and stable. Conscripting the Downtrodden is done in Tangiers. Great, that'll be more levy for me. We can boost that up once again. Let's do it. And that means we're probably about to finish this one here in Fez soon as well. Yeah, so this is good. I mean, I can afford to lose a little bit of prestige. That's really not that big of a deal. Getting the extra levy, though, that's significant. All right, I need to end this video, I think. Um, the realm is better than it was. It's still not quite good enough. I can go to the next level of Crown Authority to demand extra money and levy, but people will be very angry if I do that. Let me just take a look at this real quick. No. I don't think there's really much advantage to this right now. I mean, granted, it's another 25% levy and, ta and uh, tax con contribution. I mean, maybe. It's just going to create an extremely unstable realm with a lot of angry vassals. But if I'm powerful enough, do we care? Something we'll consider for later. Thank you all very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this train wreck. If so, then I would ask you to hit that like. What's going on over here? I would ask you to hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time.